Kluth, where's the team? It's time to do the news. News team, assemble! News team, assemble! Let's go, guys. You gotta start the news. Okay. Well, hello, NHS. I just love my school. She doesn't even go here. It just have a lot of emotions. But your face smells like peppermint. That is so fetch. Stop trying to make fetch happen. It's not going to happen. But for real, for real, we need to get to the news. Okay. Grease Lightning. Oh, Grease Lightning. The NHS musical Grease will be this Saturday at 2.30 p.m. and 7.30 p.m. and on Sunday at 2.30 p.m. in the auditorium. Tickets are $10 and go on sale one hour before each showtime. It is general admission, so make sure you get there nice and early to get a good seat. See you there. Picture retakes for freshmen, sophomores, and juniors will be on Friday, October 11th. Flyers are available in the front office with prices for each package. If you are not satisfied with your pictures or miss during picture day, this will be your opportunity to get school pictures. All students must be phot photographed for the shadow yearbook. Big smile. IAL Seniors to a journal entry discussion board, which includes one original entry and three responses, and your IAL log are all due this Friday at midnight, so turn it in. So get this filled out as soon as possible or else you lose the freedom of IAL. And no one likes to sit at school more when they have to. That's why E-Day was created. Pay attention if you're taking the SAT Saturday, October 5th. You need to arrive at 7.30 and enter Gate 2. Testing is in English and Social Studies hallways. You must bring your admission ticket, photo ID, two pencils, and a calculator. If you don't have your ID and admission ticket, you will not be able to take the test. Students Against Cancer wants to welcome its new members to the club with a movie night this Thursday. Pick up information about the movie night on Wednesday and Thursday from Mrs. Toms in the MC main office or from Ms. Val at the FC. We look forward to seeing you there. Any student interested in playing in this year's Cops and Kids flag football game should see Mr. Nicholson in room 132. Space is limited, so stop by ASAP if you want to spot. Attention all fencers. Fence fencing practice will be held on Thursdays from 3 to 4.15 in the sophomore cafeteria beginning this week. You must turn in your completed paperwork before you can start practicing. See Mrs. Dwyer in room 212 at the main campus or 509 in the freshman campus if you need any forms. Well, Noblesville, have a great day. Eat bacon. Smell trees. Touch computers. And make sure to smile at strangers. <laughs> Later, NHS. Later, NHS. Oh, nothing. Just chilling, yelling, and especially just milling. Milling? You already know. <laughs> Alright then, time for a nap. The freshman football team kept their winning streak going at four as they beat Avon 13-10 on Monday. The Millers were led by Blake Taylor with a deep touchdown catch in Brett Bill. Harris Camp and Tyler Gonzalez with some big runs and a touchdown. Defense stopped the run, had a big interception, and tipped a field goal that would have tied the game with no time left on the clock. The Millers play HSE next Monday at home. Your Lady Miller volleyball team played a great game against Lawrence Central last night. They bumped, set, and spiked their way to victory in games 1, 2, and 4. Keep on keeping on, girls. If you are interested in being on the swimming and diving team, the call-out meeting is on Monday, October 7th, right after school at the pool. Anyone who is interested should attend.
Alright NHS, it's Cancer Awareness Month and the game on Friday is Pink Out. Pink's all I have in my closet. That's cool. Only real men with me. Peace NHS. Hi, would you like to be on the field during halftime of the October 4th football game instead of in the stands? The Marching Millers are looking for 70 people to perform with them. All you have to do is stand in the spot we tell you and run off the field when we tell you. You'll need to come to a practice on October 3rd so we can show you where to stand. It's going to be pretty awesome and we hope that you want to be a part of it. Watch this short video clip that will give you a little bit better idea of what we're trying to do.